హలో వ్యూవర్స్ వెల్కమ్ టు మై యూట్యూబ్ ఛానల్ ఫిజిక్స్ వరల్డ్ బై స్పార్క్ సుధాకర్ ఇన్ దిస్ ఛానల్ ఐఎమ్ గోయింగ్ టు రిలీజ్ ఎ సిరీస్ ఆఫ్ లెక్చర్స్ ఇన్ ఫిజిక్స్ విచ్ ఐ థింక్ విల్ బీ యూస్ఫుల్ ఫర్ ఆల్ దోస్ స్టూడెంట్స్ హూ ఆర్ ప్రిపేరింగ్ ఫర్ నీట్ ఎగ్జామ్ ఆర్ ఐఐటి జేఈ స్టార్టింగ్ ఫ్రమ్ నీట్ అండ్ ఐఐటి జేఈ టు దోస్ హూ ఆర్ కంప్లీట్ దర్ గ్రాడ్యుయేషన్ ప్రిపేరింగ్ ఫర్ Uh, IIT JAM or MSc Physics entrances like JNU entrance or HCU entrance or BHU entrance like that. And apart from that, those who have finished their MSc Physics, those who are preparing for CSIR, JRF, NET exam or GATE Physics exam also. Okay, these topics will be useful. My name is Sudhakar Prakki. I am Director of Spark Institute of Physics, Hyderabad, Telangana. I have nearly 25 years of experience in giving lectures for all these students. And I had the opportunity to train thousands of students. into these various prestigious institutes all over india many of my students are in like iits or iisc okay now i am entering into the online platform to reach the students all over india in this pandemic time because students we cannot expect students to come all over india to hyderabad and take physical classes so i am trying to reach out to all the students whoever uh, wherever they are okay here the topics which i am going to choose are which most of the students feel slightly complicated aspects in physics okay and most of the students it's feel that physics itself is very complicated okay right physics is not a complicated topic where you have to solve hundreds and thousands of problems etc most of the students will be feeling like that which i have seen physically but yes there are hundreds and thousands of problems no doubt but you don't have to solve each and every problem you understand the concept in physics thoroughly okay to understand whether you have understood the concept or not okay to make it clear you solve some 30 40 different types of problems de- uh, depending on the level of your exam okay depending on the exam you are preparing at what level questions come you try to solve some modal problems in that aspect that will be sufficient you don't have to solve thousands of problems which are there in books okay so problem solving is only to understand how well we have understood the concept at solve okay right so in that aspect if physics is learned conceptually it becomes the most interesting subject and the most easy subject also okay here i'll try to do my part as much as possible in this online coaching program online lectures okay and try to do justice as much as possible all i expect from you whoever is interested in watching my videos right i expect only two things from you one is interest in the subject okay you should have a devotional interest to learn the subject of course you are preparing for a specific exam no doubt you want to crack that exam right that's your ultimate aim that is understood okay but while studying the subject okay you should not think about the exam you should try to understand the concept there okay and second one is have one dev- analytical mind okay develop some analytical mind that is whatever concept you have understood you should be in a position to apply that okay in various aspects how to apply where to apply in what ways problems can be expected from this thing that way your aim while you are learning the subject your aim you should not think about the exam you are preparing for you should think about learning the subject okay once you have understood subject exam is simply a way in a, a something a point a important point in your way that's all that's how you should feel okay that makes learning the subject interesting and learning the subject easy also especially a subject like physics and apart from lectures which are useful for these competitive exams all india level competitive exams okay you will find some lectures in this course which are useful for in general anybody who is interested in learning what is happening around the world certain things happen in nature and we will be wondering why things are happening in the way they are happening okay right many things happen in nature with a specific purpose in a specific way they will be happening okay for example nature always prefers disorder we say means you take a well maintained park if you leave that park for one year it will become a forest in nature forests only grow okay no no planet and forests only grow naturally but we don't expect parks parks are man made always 
okay a hot cup of tea always becomes cold why not a cold cup of tea become hot by itself okay why our gas stove flame is always blue in color etc some things are in nature right which everybody wants to know why sky is blue these things okay the for people with scientific temper these things will be interesting to know okay some topics will be like that if you have any if you are interested in any one specific topic for me to cover you can always contact this number okay or you can express your uh, views and uh, suggestions in the comments box below you want any specific topic for nutrition i'll try to cover the topic also as early as possible okay please uh, subscribe to my video if you like these videos and uh, suggest it to your friends and other members also okay thank you